here is our next video for the narcotic drugs and psychotropic substances act 1985 we are going to discuss the other provisions of this act which is given in the narcotic drug 1985 in this video we are going to discuss these topics and we are able to understand what is the narcotic drug and psychotropic substances act and what are the provisions are given in this narcotic drug and psychotropic substances act 1985 In previous lecture we have discussed the introductory part of this act and we are going to discuss the other provisions of this act according to our presentation on this act The Narcotic Drug and Act Psychotropic Substances at 1985 have passed In, uh, at the day of 16 September 1985 an act to consolidate and amend the law relating to narcotic drug to make treatment provision for the control and regulation of operations relating to narcotic drugs and psychotropic substances to provide the fortifier of property property derived from or used in illicit traffic in narcotic drug and psychotropic substances to implement the provisions of the international convention on narcotic drug and psychotropic substances and for matters connected there with be it enacted by parliament in 36 year of the republic of india as follows chapter 1 we have pre previously discussed that any act has many chapters in the series of the chapters the chapter 1 preliminary short title and commencement extent of this act this act may be called as the narcotic drug and psychotropic substances act 1985 it extend to whole the whole of india and is applies also to all citizen of india outside to all persons on ship and aircraft registered in india where they may be it shall come into force on such data such date three as the central government may by notification in the official gazette appoint and the different dates may be appointed for different provisions of this act and for different state and any references in such provisions or to the commencement of the act shall be constructed in the relation of any state as a reference to the coming into force of the previous to that provision that in the state there are some definitions which are the part of this act the definition of in this act unless the contents otherwise require first definition is addict who is addict by the by this act addict means a person who has dependence on any narcotic drug or psychotropic substance in other ways we can say that any person who cannot survive who cannot live who cannot live his life properly without without the narcotic drug that can addict that can be said to be addict what is the definition of board means central board of excise and customs constitute under the central board of revenue act 1963 54 section 54 of the 
कैनाबिस कैनाबिस मीन्स हेम एंड चरस दैट इज द सेपरेटेड रेजिन इन वॉट एवर फ्रॉम फॉर्म वेदर क्रूड और प्योरिफाइड ऑप्टेन्ड फ्रॉम द कैनाबिस प्लांट एंड ऑल्सो इंक्लूड कंसनट्रेटेड प्रिपरेशन एंड रेजिन नोन एज हशीश ऑयल और लिक्विड हशीश गांजा दैट इज द फ्लावरिंग और फ्रूटिंग टॉप्स ऑफ द ऑफ द प्लांट कैनाबिस एक्सक्लूडिंग द सीड्स एंड लीव्स वेन नॉट एकड बाई द टॉप्स बाई वॉट एवर नेम दे मे बी नोन और डेजिग्नेटेड एंड एनी मिक्सचर विथ और विदाउट एनी नेचुरल मटीरियल ऑफ एनी ऑफ द एव फॉर्म्स ऑफ द कैनाबिस और एनी ड्रिंक prepared their form cannabis plant means any plant of the genus cannabis central government factories when we call the factory central government factories there are the definition there is a definition for this means factories owned by the central government or factories owned by any company in which the central government holds at least 51% of the paid up share capital when the capital of this any company shared by central government in the 51% that is called the central government factory coca derivative means what should said be to be coca derivative coca derivatives means cocaine that is an extract of coca leaf which can be used directly or indirectly for the manufacture of the cocaine crude cocaine means that any extract can be used for the manufacture of cocaine econi ecogenin ecogenin egonin and all the derivatives of the egonin from which it can be recovered cocaine that is methyl ester or benzoyl econi econin and its salt and all the preparation containing more than 0.1% of the cocaine coca leaves means the leaves of the coca plant except the leaves except the leaves from which all ecogene cocaine and any other ecogene alkaloid have been removed any mixture there of with or without any natural material but does not include any preparation containing more than 1% of the cocaine coca plants coca plants coca plants means that the plants of any species of genus pertroloxin commercial quantity commercial quantities are in relation to narcotic drug and psychotropic substances means any quantity greater than the quantity specified by the central government by notification on the official gadget controlled delivery 
means the technique of following of allowing illicit or suspect consignment of narcotic drugs psychotropic substances controlled substances or substances substituted for them to pass out of or through or into territory of india with the knowledge or uh, and under the supervision of an officer empowered in the behalf of duly authorized under the section 50a with the review of the identifying the persons involving the commission of an offence under this act the next de definition is corresponding law corresponding law means any law corresponding to the provisions of this act controlled substance mean any substance which uh, which the central government may having regard to the available information as to its possible use in the production of manufacture of narcotic drugs or psychotropic substances of the provision of any international convention by notification in the official gazette declared to be the controlled substances convenience means a convenience of any description whatsoever and includes any aircraft vehicle or vessel essential narcotic drug means the narcotic drug notified by the central government for medical and scientific use the third the illicit traffic in relation to narcotic drug and uh, psychotropic substances means cultivating any coca plant or gathering any portion of coca plant cultivating the opium poppy or any cannabis plant engaging in the introduction manufacture processing sale purchase transportation warehousing concealment or using the consumption import interstate export interstate import into india export from india or uh, transshipment of narcotic drug or psychotropic substances dealing in an activities of narcotic drug and psychotropic substances other than those referred in sub class 1 to handling or letting out any premises for the carrying of on one or any activities referred in the sub class 1 and 4 then those permitted under this act or any rule or order made of or any conditions of any license term authorization issued they are under and include financing directly or indirectly any of the enforcemental activities abetting or conspiring conspiring the furtherance of or in support of doing any uh, of the enforcemental activities 
एंड हार्बरिंग पर्सन इंगेज इन एनी ऑफ द एफोर मैं एक्टिविटीज इंटरनेशनल कन्वेक्शन मीन्स द सिंगल कन्वेक्शन ऑफ नार्कोटिक ड्रग नाइनटीन फिफ्टी एट एडोप्टेड बाई द यूनाइटेड नेशन कॉन्फ्रेंस एट न्यूयॉर्क इन नाइनटीन सिक्सटी वन द प्रोटोकॉल amending the convention mentioned in sub clause adopting by the united nation conference at geneva in march 1972 the convention of psychotropic substances 1971 adopted by the united nation conference of vienna in february 1971 and any other international convention or protocol or the instrument amended and international convention relating to narcotic drug and psychotropic substances which may ratified or exceeded by the commencement of this act what is the definitions of the manufacture manufacture in relation or to narcotic drug and psychotropic substances include manufacture all the process other than production by which such drugs or substances may be obtained refining of such drugs or substances transformation of such drug or substances and making of preparation otherwise than in a pharmacy prescriptions with or containing such drug or substances manufacturing drug means all coca derivative medicinal cannabis opium derivative and poppy straw concentrate any other narcotic substances or preparation which the central government may having regard to the available information as to its nature to a decision if any under any international convention by notification in the official gadget declared to be manufacture of drug but does not include any narcotic substances or preparation when the central government may having regard to the available information as to its nature second one is medicinal cannabis that is medicinal hemp means any extract of or tincture of cannabis hemp narcotic commissioners means narcotic commissioner appointment appointed under section 5 narcotic drug means coca leaf cannabis opium poppy straw include all manufacture of drug opium the coagulated juice of the opium poppy and mixture were with or without any natural material of the coagulated juice of opium poppy it but does not include any preparation containing more than 0.2% of morphine opium derivative or opium derivative process processes necessary to adapt medicinal use according with the requirement of indian pharmacopoeia and other pharmacopoeia notified in the behalf of by central government whether in the power from the granulated or otherwise or mixed natural material prepared opium that is an product of opium obtained by a series of operation phenethrin alkaloid namely morphine codeine thiabine and their salt diacetylomorphine that is alkaloid prepared by dimorphine heroin or its salt all preparation containing more than 0.2% 
of morphine or containing any diacetyl morphine opium poppy means the plant of the species papaver somniferum and the plant of any species papaver somniferum opium and the plant pantheon alkaloid can be extracted and which the central government may notification in the official gazette declare to be opium for the purpose of this act poppy straw means all the part except the seed of the opium poppy after harvesting whether in their original form cut or cut or poppy straw means all the parts of harvesting with their original form of cut crushed or powdered and whether or not juice that has been extracted there from poppy straw concentrate means the material arising when poppy straw has entered into the process of the concentration of its alkaloid preparation in the relation of narcotic drug and psychotropic substances means any one or more than such drug of substances doses or many any solution or mixture in whatever physical state containing one or more such drugs or substances prescribed means the prescribed by rules under the act production means the separation of opium poppy straw coca leaves or cannabis plant psychotropic substances means any substances natural or synthetic or any natural material or any salt or any preparation or of such substance or material include in the list of psychotropic substances is specified in the schedule to export from india with the grammatical variation so see some definition of what import sell small quantities import into india to export for, from india The grammatical variation cognate expression means to take out of India to a place outside of India. To export interstate means to take out at a state union territory, India, Indian, other and union territory. To transport means take from one place to another place within the same state or union territory. used in relation of narcotic in relation to narcotic and psychotropic substances many and means any kind of use except personal consumption words are expressions use herein herein and not be defined in the code of criminal procedure 1973 Here is the one definition: power to add or omit the list of psychotropic substances. The central government may be satisfied, is satisfied that it is necessary to expedient. So to do so, the basic of the information and evidences 
which has become available to it with respect to the nature and effect of the abuse or scope of abuse of any substances natural or synthetic or natural material or any salt or preparation of such substances of material and the modification or provision which they have been to or any international convention with respect to such substances natural material the salt preparation of the such substances or material here is the chapter second authorities and officer central government to take measures to preventing the combating use of any illicit traffic in this drug and narcoto drug and psychotropic substances central government shall take measures to stem authorities and officers assistance to the con concerned authorities in foreign countries and concerned international organizations with a view to facilitating coordination and universal action to prevention suspension of illicit traffic in narcotic drug and psychotropic substances identification treatment education after care rehabilitation and social reintegration of addicts availability of narcotic drug and psychotropic substances for medical and scientific use such other matters as the central government deems necessary or expedient to for the purpose of securing the effective implementation implementation of the provision of this act and preventing the combating the abuse of narcotic drugs and psychotropic substances and illicit traffic therein authority and officers assistant to the concentrated authority in foreign countries and concentrated international organization identification treatment education after care rehabilitation and social reintegration of addicts availability of narcotic drugs and psychotropic substances for medical and scientific use such other matter as the central government deems necessary or expedient for the exposure purpose of securing the effective implementation of the provision of this act and preventing the combating the abuse of narcotic drug and psychotropic substances and illicit traffic therein the central government may if it considers in necessary to expedient so to do so for the purpose of this act by order published in the official gazette constitute an authority or hierarchy of authority by such name or names as may be specified in the order for the purpose or exercising such of the powers and functions of the central government under this act and for taking measures with respect to such of the matters referred to sub section 2 as may be mentioned in the order to and subject to supervision and control of the central government and the provision of such order authority or authorities may exercise the power and take the measures so mentioned in the order as if such authorities or authorities has been empowered by this act to exercise those powers to take such measures officers of central government without prejudice the provision of sub section 3 of section 
द सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट शेल अपॉइंट अ नार्कोटिक्स कमिश्नर एंड मे ऑल्सो अपॉइंट सच अदर ऑफिसर विथ सच डेजिग्नेशन एज इट इज थिंक फिट फॉर द पर्पज ऑफ दिस एक्ट सम ऑफ दी अथॉरिटीज आर क्रिएटेड बाय दिस एक्ट फॉर द फॉर द स्मूथ work of the of the office office staff and the central government and the power may be delegated delegated to all the officers and all the uh, departments of this narcotic section the narcotic commissioner shall either by himself or through officers subordinate to him exercise all the power and perform all function relating to the superintendence of the cultivation of the opm poppy and production of the opm and shall also exercise and perform such other powers and function as may be in interested to him by the central government the officers appointed under subsection 1 shall be subject to the general control and direction of the central government or so directed by the government also of the board of any authority of officer so these are the structure of the central government officing authority which are used which are used for the statement and the proper work for the narcotic department in india so the central government have such, such powers they give our power they give their power to delegate in the state government and the proper smooth work of the government should be done under the supervision of the central government the central government is responsible for all the act export import cultivation collection and different type of activities related to the psychotropic and narcotic substances they all have been done under the restrict or supervision of the central government and the state government there after they do their work with the help of the government any cultivator any type of manufacturer or any type of uh, any type of processor they all have are come under this act and they are governed by the central body and they are also governed by the state body in accordance to this law the narcotic drug and psychotropic substance consultative committee first we see what is the work of the what is the essential yeah essentiality of this work, of this committee the narcotic drug and psychotropic substance consultative committee give their consultation for any type of activities related with these type of narcotic drug and psychotropic substances the narcotic drug and psychotropic substances consultative committee the central government may constitute by notification in the official gazette an advisory committee to be called narcotic drug and psychotropic substance consultative committee here after in this section referred to as the committee to advise the central government on such matter relating to the administration of this act are referred to be it to it by the by that government from time to time the committee shall consist of a chairman this is the structure of a committee we are going to discuss what is the structure and how many officers and how many workers are, are come under the committee the committee shall consist of a chairman and such other members not exceeding 20 the members of this committee cannot be exceed more than 
as may be appointed by the central government. They all have been appointed by the central government with the help of a official gazette. The committee shall meet when required to do so by the central government and shall have power to regulate its own procedure. The committee may, if it deems it necessary, so do so to do for the efficient discharge of any its function constitute one or more subcommittee and may appoint to any such subcommittee whether generally or for the consideration of any particular matter any person including a non official who is not the member of the committee the term of office of the manner of filling casual vacancy in the office offices of and the allowances if any payable to the chairman and other members of the committee and the conditions of restriction subjected to which the committee may appoint a person who is not a member of the committee as a member of any of its subcommittee shall be such as may be prescribed by the rules made by the central government. These all activities of the committee, the substance, the narcotic drug and psychotropic substance consultative, consultative committee shall be done in the supervision of the central government with the help of the official gadget. Officers of the state government, officers of the state government, the state government may appoint such officer with such designation as it thinks fit for the purpose of this act 11. The officer's appointment under subsection 1 shall be subjected to the general control and direction of the state government or if so directed by the that government also of any other authority of, of or officer. So these, this is in the, in this video, we have to discuss all the committees and all the definitions after the introduction part, we are going to summarize this video. This is the short summary for this video. First we, firstly, we have discussed about the Narcotic Drug and Psychotropic Substances Act 1985 when it is passed. The time is 16 September 1985. What are the powers of this act and why, what is the objective of this act? An act to consolidate and amend the law relating to the narcotic drug. The narcotic drug relating law or where they are using, they all have been amended and changed by this new law to make strict provision for the control and regulation of the operations relating to narcotic drug and psychotropic substances. In this scenario, we have seen all the aspects of this act to provide the faulty feature for property derived from use illicit traffic in narcotic drugs psychotropic substances in implement provision of international conservation of narcotic drug and psychotropic substances these are related to the objective of this act 
and this act came in the 36th year of the Republic of India as follows. Here the chapter 1 contains short title, extent and commencement. The name of this act is given in this chapter. In extent to whole in India, it applies also like the act of Nar narcotic drug and psychotropic substances 1985. To all persons or ship and aircraft registered in India, they all follow this rule and know the act named with Narcotic Drugs and Psychotropic Substances Act. So we have seen what are the objectives and why the act should be required for the Indian government. So we are going to discuss the definition or summarize the definition part. Here many type of definition are given that, that have been used in the remaining part of the act. Addict, what is addict and what is board, what is cannabis, what is charas, ganja and cannabis plant, any mixture of this. There are some definitions about central government factories, coca derivatives, crude cocaine, ecogene, cocaine and coca leaf. What is the coca plant, commercial quantity, controlled delivery, corresponding law, controlled substances. What are the convenience, essential narcotic drug, illicit traffic, cultivation and collection of the opium, engaging the production, manufacturer, processing, sale, purchase, transportation, warehousing, concealment, consumption, import. Export into state and uh, uh, into under into state and after state. Some definition dealing with the activities narcotic drug and psychotropic substances that are referred in subclass one to four five. International convention definition, protocol amending convention mentioned. What are the definition of manufacturer? Refining, making, manufacture drug. Coca derivatives, what are the coca derivatives, what are the medicinal cannabis, narcotic commissioner, who is narcotic commissioner, what is the definition of the narcotic commissioner, narcotic drug and coca leaf, cannabis hemp, opium, poppy straw, including all manufactured drugs, what is the meaning of an opium, opium derivative, medicinal opium, what is prepared opium, what is penanthrene, what is diethyl, what is diacetyl morphine, all the preparation containing more than 0.2% of morphine or containing diacetyl morphine, what are the opium poppy, what is the species of the papaver family used for the cultivation of this drug, what is poppy straw, what is poppy straw concentrate, Preparation, prescribed production. These all are the definitions given for the example of these things which are used in the rest of this act. So, chapter 2 give the authorities and officer. Authorities and officers, some officers are central central officers and some, some officers are state officers. Officers of central government, the narcotic drug and psychotropic substances consult, consultative committee. What are the, who are the officers of the state government and what is, who, which act govern this topic. This is from my side in this video and after this video the third part of the narcotic drug and psychotropic substances we have been discussed in after wear.
द फोर कमिंग वीडियो इज इज शॉर्टली बी अपलोडेड बाय मी सो थैंक यू